Hey guys, welcome back to the On the Bench podcast. I'm your host Adrian Bird. Alongside me is Josh Peak and Peyton Anderson, and we have a great podcast for you guys today. So this weekend concluded the Savannah tournament. Your girls did take first. They were the Savannah tournament champions. We have a be- we have a lady cardinal here with us. So would you like to tell okay, us a little bit? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? You gotta talk loud. Would you like to tell us about how the tournament went? We won. Obviously, like so we did good. It's the good to the bads, though. Oh, what? Um, what do you guys need? Why is there fifty eight right there? What happened with that? Yeah. Our defense was bad. That's why. Should have held them to like twenty points. Yeah, our defense was bad, but not gonna win. We made a lot of threes, so <laughs> that was good. You guys expect to win state with fifty eight <laughs> points? They scored it was like sixty seven. Fourth game the pr- in the season. Pr- pr- Gilbert, what? How much did those? They bad shouldn't, shouldn't have scored. Did they win by nine? Points, but is that what that means? Yeah. Yes. Okay. 67 it should have been more, but it'll get better. I mean, yeah. well, wins a win at the end of the day. Win is a win. All right, and uh, moving on to boys basketball. Yeah, it's me. Uh, we and or the boys basketball did end up taking fifth place, beating Flat County, who they faced again Tuesday at seven here at Springer Gymnasium. So that should be an exciting game, close game. Um, ended on some missed free throws by Platte County. So we're just looking to make sure that we're not winning because they missed free throws this time. Are you guys doing better, Bird? We should be doing better. We're um, on a two-game win streak. We're, you're on we're on a two-game two game win streak. streak. We're off to a better start than we uh, started the season off at. So that's always positive. Wait, wait okay, never mind. Does that not you're make going sense? on a run. It makes sense. A win streak. We're off to a better start. Yeah, we're on a little... Started the season. Well, we started off 0-2, and, and now we're 2-2. and two. You're better than you were at the beginning of the season. Yeah. That That's what I just said. That's not what you said. The girls are undefeated. <laughs> girls don't lose. Okay. We yeah. are. So you go to no state. And Give you us lose. those credit. You go to state and don't bring back a title for the third time in a row. We will this year. We'll win. Okay. That's a promise. Sure. I promise. All right. Um, <laughs> That's not what I just clicked on. Why? A little bit of technical difficulty. Go up, sorry. bird. Go, go up. up. Where do I go up to? Dude, go to the top. Oh my, it's backwards from mine. All right. No, it's not. What are you talking so, about? wrestling had a tournament. Yes, okay. <laughs> wrestling had a tournament. So, the girls wrestled Friday. Tatum took third, and Jaden Vice took fifth. So, good job to them. The boys wrestled Friday and Saturday. Ethan took Ethan Nash took second. Bishop Rush took fourth. Gage Snodgrass took fifth, and Caden Lee took fifth. So, pretty successful tournament. We only took, like, six people. Yeah. Or six boys. And, like, four, four of the least. Four Oh, my. I need to get this picture. You guys continue to. I'm going to have it. We're going to find a way to get this picture. It's Kevin Machado, after his match, covered in someone else's blood. It's pr- the coolest picture I think I've ever seen. Oh, boy. Yeah, it's. Oh. Is it tough? It's tough. But it's a really good picture. Um, he ended up losing his match. <laughs> but it was still really cool. Yeah. It was a good tournament. It's a hard tournament. So it is a hard tournament. It's two days, I believe. Having that many it? people. It's an overnight tournament. Yeah. yeah. Having that many people plays a great game. Yeah. And uh, moving on to tonight, your Lady Cardinals face off against Savannah. So they're there for the third game in a row now. Fourth. Fourth. My bad. Fourth game in a row they, at are Savannah. Gonna, are you going to win? We should. I've heard that this is. there's a little bit of tension in this game. Can no I? comment. No comment. <laughs> Wait, what? I want to know what's going on. No. Would you like to tell him? No. Peyton, what's what's going on? There's well, no do you know why? Um, I can't even think of his name. The guy who's like, what happened? Yeah, that guy. Do you know why he hates? Um, what school does he hate? USC. USC. You know why he hates them so why? much? Because their coach left. Uh, Jerry Lincoln or Lincoln? T- what's his name? The one that he hates so much. Oh. Uh, yeah. What about it? Well, that's very similar to what's happening right now. They're playing their old coach. Oh, is it? Fulton, or Banks. It's Banks? Yeah. Yeah, we should stop him. It's a whole new coach, though, because it's not even Bolton. It's Banks this time, so it's different. But um, that should be an exciting game. (laughs) Exhilarating. No. No? I want it to be a blowout. What's your prediction for the game, score-wise? I don't know. I don't have a prediction. Girls What's the game plan going like 12 to 5. 12 to 5? What's the prediction? It'll Josh, be like, you don't know anything. I play, I, he played <laughs> I play basketball. No. <laughs> I know, but I watched girl, You know how many games When was the last year? time you played an actual like regulated basketball game? 7th grade. 
Devin Street. That's not that far. Like, I played a whole he season. He played against Tony Osborne. I did. Tony Osborne dropped, like, 60 points on my team. <laughs> <laughs> so I had, like, a record, had a record breaking that. My team wasn't even bad. We were weird. We went. We won more than we lost. And Tony Osborne came in. I thought that about football, too. I thought we were going to was in eighth grade and just started smacking threes. Well, he got his first dunk in, like, sixth grade. Oh, my sure. gosh, dude. Or is that kid? Pretty sure he set, like, a scoring record for yeah. Missouri Middle School that night. Because it was insane. Probably. They're up, like, 70 He's to a 40. D1 athlete. He has really good basketball. Oh, no. I just ruined my shot. I've got, I have technically guarded him before. I mean, I guarded him for, like, one like one second at the very end of the game. Put me in at the end of the game. But. <laughs> so, were you one of the kids who went in off the bench okay. at the end of games? It was 7th and 8th grade. I was in 7th grade. And I was puny. We had... I was at a country school. Those well, people were like 6'5 in 8th grade. Okay, well, how come you didn't play with us in 8th grade? You could have. Because I don't want to. Our team wasn't good. Why would you I? You could have played. No, I wouldn't have. Have you seen me play? I probably wouldn't play now. Myself now probably wouldn't have played with an 8th grade team. It's horrible. Yes, you would have. We had like two people who could dribble a ball well, on the team. Basically, I have played basketball. I played basketball. In eighth grade, Denver Doman was not the beast that he is today. In eighth grade, Denver Doman couldn't dribble a ball. I played basketball. Save his life. I played basketball for a long time. But he's a dog. All the way from like second, he had a three. second to seventh grade. I played basketball for like five years. Five years. Oh, but I'm aren't you so like the next good. Ronaldo? From what I, what we were talking about earlier. Oh my gosh. Freak out. Who would win in a soccer match between Adley the college soccer laughing. player or Josh Peak? Me. I don't know. I would beat you in soccer. I don't Adley was nothing. laughing. If there I was a team, I don't want to say nothing, but I'm cracked. Peyton, if there was a game, I used, there if was it was me and clubs, Bird versus like you and pick somebody from that college, me and Bird are winning. winning, and it's not close. Okay, Peyton, look. Okay. If there's a team of eleven okay. Peyton Andersons and a team of eleven Adrian Bird, my team wins every time. That's true. That is 100% true. Better goalkeeper. Like, listen. Hey, I, I was a goalie back in my day. I, I was really a goalie, was, too. I was, I was the leading scorer. I score. was terrible. I was, if we had strike, like, we played bad, we played bad teams. And they tried to get me, I mean, I have one goal. My, my whole life in soccer, I have one goal. Because I was always too scared to shoot the ball. Because I thought I'd get yelled at. I was too, the reason I was so good at soccer is because I knew I'd get yelled at if I sucked. So you were good at it? Yes. It's the only reason I did good is because I knew if I didn't, then I would get screamed at. Okay, that logic is like not right. So you played out of fear. Yes. Not I out played of well. Skill. After every single game, I was like, Coach Jack played well tonight. <laughs> and every single game, he said, like, Yeah, he, he said, You played like an animal. You probably buddy. went up and <laughs> were like, What can I work on? No. What grade was oh, this in? Yeah. I was cracked. What Why grade was this, you? Josh? Fourth. <laughs> <laughs> I was cracked. Dude, my team would. My fourth no, grade, I'm not even saying my, anything about your my team. My third team. grade soccer team. I know exactly who your soccer team is. Definitely be our big girls soccer team right now. It would probably okay, be our big boys. It soccer. wouldn't that be close. Terrible. It'd probably be our boys. So our team was cracked. Yeah. All the LeBlanc tough. kids that play soccer. All the LeBlanc Central. They were all on my team. We were amazing. Yeah. Aiden, Aiden, Noah, Noah, uh, Landon, Gar. Yeah. He don't really play soccer anymore. Landon. Oh my gosh, there's so many kids. Who's your Jeffrey. Family? Who the heck is Jeffrey? Epstein? Bomber? No, Jeffrey. What was his last name? Oh. I don't know. It's a kid named Andrew. Had this kid named Miguel on our team. Miguel? He sounds like he was your leading scorer. Yeah, he was on the bench. He really? Yes. Uh, Jackson. We were so good. That Did Jackson play with you guys? Jackson. See, Chris? I don't know. Probably. I, don't know. I played. I played. Is like, I, pl- I played with Connor before. Connor Mears? Yeah. I played him. You're so cool, Josh. You know, I think I'm pretty sure I played good Peyton's team. Like, I were you guys orange? Honestly, yes. Soccer in high school? I played you, against your Are you team. kidding me? Well, well, Bird. Well, I know that it is now. I know that it is now. What, did you just ask me what club team I played for? No, I know what Bird. club team you Bird. played for. I don't, I, oh my okay, God. it was like fourth grade. Hey. And we played a girls team, and they you beat us by like 60. Listen, and Ryan Schaeferbeier starts crying on the field because be. the ball hit her in her chest. Yeah, and that was me. Down, I, my young team your butt. might not be a team of I years, scored all the goals. Our Benton girls soccer we team won. has struggled we have. recently. If you guys had we got team, better last season. Really if I was on your guys' team, we would. you guys would have been undefeated. That's not, Okay, Bird. Right. That, I don't know about that. Their best player is never playing again. I'm going to go. I'm going to go for a... I'm slide tackling. That's like me trying to talk about me being good at football. You'd be like, terrible. I'm okay, terrible. listen. But you'd, that's be, like, you'd be better than a lot of our You know nothing players. about soccer. I, I don't know nothing need to. I'm football. a better athlete than everyone on the field. If I'm so I'm like, what is there to know about right. soccer? All like, right. really? You just have to be skilled. You don't even have to like, like, as long as you don't have dri- If you can dribble the bar, you can be tough. Okay. You guys don't have the soccer skills. What are you talking about? 
I before I move on. Used to be is not. No, I could. If, if I get, if you gave me time out, one time week out, time out. to practice time soccer, out. I'd be crack. Because <laughs> that makes a difference. No, it doesn't. I do not need any skill. That's and true. I would go ham. Uh, okay, let's let's put it this way. Benton's soccer team, Benton Boys Soccer, I'd start. I, they tried to recruit me this year. Benton Boys Soccer, recruit? I would start. But yes, if I was on your team, Benton. though, if I was on your team, I would be the leading scorer. I was defense. Okay, I was I terrible. Like, I would never give you the ball. I would never give you the ball. But I was a defense. I was locked down on defense. I think that I if we had an Iron Man. But football, what's that called? A powder puff, but where guys got to play, it's like a league. So a what? A For flag football? Fo- yeah, if we had a flag football league and we got to make our own teams, the team that I am on would be unstoppable because we're having we're having Casey Mose as our receiver. What are you talking about? Adrian, what I hope you? you as a football player would be good at football. Yeah, what are you talking like, about? Like, that I don't know. Sense. I started going on a rant. It's just you and Casey versus I hope like you could all the football. other football athletes wouldn't win flag football. What? Flag football? Devin could cover. No, we can't. I'll throw the ball up. He's not getting to it. Anytime that a team threw the ball over Devin's head, it was a head tap. Love Devin, but it happened like five times. Devin's not going to be. Casey's not a route runner, man. Devin's Casey's routes are going to be terrible. Devin can. Well, this is last year. Okay, so why are we talking about last year? Okay, Devin, who's guarding Devin either? Casey's not guarding him. Make him run a route outside of the field. Guys, if he runs out, why would you guys play powder puff? For football. Let's do a soccer. Let's take it up. Let's that get like a football soccer match going. What? Because I want to play soccer. Honestly, playing today in the gym. Exactly. It brought back memories. It really did. Oh like I, it's no. Every time I play soccer, it's like, you know, my my brother. Every time he comes to town, we still go out to Spring Garden and play soccer. <laughs> Why? Because we love it. You just love it. Why didn't you play it then? Because Landon convinced me. Because <laughs> worst decision of my life. So you was so you made other people happy instead of yourself. No, Landon That's today's lesson. He's like, you're you being good at football. The lesson for today is don't live your life soccer. trying to make other people happy. I Do what you. makes you happy, as long as it's not like killing people. I wish I played soccer so much, but football's fun. That's today's football's more fun. life lesson. But soccer, like, dribbling past somebody is just like such a good feeling. Mm-hmm. You know what else is a good feeling? I actually Running know what that feels like, and I promise. Running over someone. I promise I know what it feels like. Not very. You guys like my hat. Oh, it's spotted the wrong way. Wait, what were you, a striker? I was everything. Okay, I'm being so serious. I'm, being I know, so serious. I'm starting to be like, okay. wait, like I can. My I'm team was very unstructured. I get beat right now, one on one. Okay. I was. Very, I'm not confident. My team was very unstructured. I, I was one on one versus like an actual soccer. Player. I beat Peyton in a one on one. I had beat Peyton in a one on one. But you were confident. I beat Peyton in a one on one soccer match. That's true. I'm I, better than a Northwest soccer player. I beat you in one on one. Hey, I beat Eliana and Adley combined. Combined. Just, okay. You're playing street soccer. Ah, in Florida, you can ask him both. All right, we have four minutes, guys, so let's wrap Okay, up. good, good. Anyways, moral of the story is I'm better than her at soccer, and this no. has been on the bench. No, we it's are not. both. Oh, what did I just practice? We are both better. <laughs>